Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics, and in this DCS F-18C Hornet video, we're taking a look at a new autopilot system coming for the Hornet in the next big update, and that's coupled mode. Now, for those of you who enjoy flying the Hornet in autopilot, well, this is going to be a dream come true. In a nutshell, coupled mode allows the aircraft to automatically fly to a designated location. Uh, such a location could be a waypoint, a tack end station, or a ground target designation when you have a weapon mode that has an ASL or an asthma steering line. Let's go ahead and unpause. So we can see that we're already in barometric altitude hold. Let's select waypoint mode, waypoint one. At the bottom here we have auto mode and as you may recall this allows us to automatically cycle to the next waypoint sequence once we reach the current one. So auto on the HSI up ahead we can see our waypoint and now that we have a waypoint designated we have CPL for coupled at the bottom of the option select windows. We'll colonize that and the aircraft will now fly directly to that waypoint, waypoint one in this case. Now if we don't want it to fly directly to that waypoint we want to go uh, there on a selected course line we can go to the uh, course switch hold it down and we can already see the aircraft is now trying to fly itself to align itself on that course line to that waypoint up on the HUD we have our couple waypoint indication down on the HSI we have couple waypoint as well as well as our true airspeed and our ground speed Distance waypoint one is 4.6 miles. And again, once we reach that uh, first waypoint, it should automatically then cycle to that second waypoint and start flying to that one under coupled mode. Okay, one mile. Okay, now it's cycled to waypoint two. We're still in couple modes, so now it's automatically flying to that waypoint. So the next way we can do it is through a TAC end station. We have an uh, insert like air base up to the north on uh, TAC end 21 X ray. So let's go to TAC end, turn it on, two, one, enter. We'll select tack in on the HSI. We can see it's still in coupled mode. So now the aircraft is automatically flying to that tack in station. And just like we did for the waypoints, we can also use the course switch to adjust the uh, course angle that we approach that tack in station at. Uh, finally, we have the ability to do it based on a target location when we have a weapon with an ASL. Let's go to air to ground mode. We have some Mark 83s on board. So right now the mode is CCIP. We'll need to go to auto. Set our fuse. Yeah, let's do that with a uh, FLIR. Okay, set our, our TDC. I'm gonna find a location out here. That's fine. So I have designated location. We now have target. And if we go to our autopilot, we'll select coupled. And now the aircraft's gonna automatically fly to that target location, pretty handy. So folks, that's a little overview of the uh, coupled waypoint mode coming down the road here in a bit. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Thanks.